Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and the reason why I'm wrapped up in my blanket because it's cold right now. I'm really cold. It's pretty late when I'm filming this and usually in Las Vegas, especially when it gets late at night, it gets really cold during the winter time and I get cold easily so that's why I have this blanket on for me for this recording. But hey, welcome back to my channel for Vlogmas Day. <laughs> Vlogmas Day. Vlogmas Day time! We're on both hands today. Soon I'll need an extra hand. So today I'm going to watch the trailer for Mary and the Witch's Flower, which is Mary no Majo no Hana. And be, and this was, I saw the trailer a, a while ago when they first did it, but I don't think I, re, I thought it looked cool, but I didn't really know that much about it. But I found I thought it was another Ghibli film, but it's not a Ghibli film. It's actually Studio 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 Ponok's first feature film movie. And the founder is Yoshiaki Nishimura or Nishimura Yoshiaki. And he's the produce he produced the Mary and the Witch's Flower. And he actually used to work for Ghibli. He used to be Ghibli's lead film producer but now he's moved on with his life and now he made he made he found the studio Ponok and then this is the, the studio's first feature film Mary and the Witch's Flower. He worked on previous films he worked on the tale of Princess Kaguya and when Mar Marnie was there and all those stuff and House Moving Castle and then yeah, so I'm excited to watch this trailer because the reason why I wanted to watch this trailer again because starting because I was looking up and I saw that they released just today or just recently they released um, the English trailer for it, the English dub trailer for Mary and the Witch's Flower and click uh, ooh. altitude. Come on, Peter, let's go. Oh. Mary, stop! Everyone knows you're not supposed to go into the woods on misty days. I found it in the woods. The witch's flower. They only bloom once every seven years. Pause for a minute. I thought this is the Japanese one, but I guess this is the English one. So I'm sorry if you don't like that, but let's just watch this. Maybe I'll do both. We'll see. Let's watch. They say witches used to seek it out. Oh my goodness, girl! What is going on? I don't know. Oh, the broom is. You need to talk to Kiki? <laughs> Tonight, I really am a witch. This is Endor College! Ooh. One of the most prestigious schools for witches. How do you do, Miss Mary? But Mary Stewart? This is amazing. That looks pretty. Ooh. Once in a century tent. A remarkable witch. Okay, I remember this kind of thing. That girl has discovered where the flowers are. The flowers. The flower. Oh, those are flowers. The flower will change the world. Pizza! No pizza! We have to go. Come on, Tib. Away! Ruby Burnhill, Kate Winslet. You're going to be the subject of my most important magical experiment. Oh. Who, who are you guys? You guys are all nice. I mustn't give up. You must not. I made a promise. You did, girl. You did. Going home together, all of us. That's right, girl. You do this, Mary. Pizza, say pizza. Oh, Mary and the witch's flower. Ooh. I want to see it. It looks cool. It kind of reminds me, it basically, it kind of reminds me of, base, it, it reminds me of Kiki's, Kiki's delivery service meeting Harry Potter. That's what I'm getting the feel of. The only thing is the broom and her black cat, kind of like, you know, Kiki's delivery service. And Harry Potter, because he's like, you're a wizard, Harry. So Mary finds out she is a wizard or a witch. And things go down, and she evolves her friend Pita and all of this. She kind of finds out who's going on. I want to see this movie. But yeah, I'm excited. I'll, I'll, I will probably see this in theaters. I'll go see this in theaters. 
Will you guys see it in theaters? If not, just wait till the DVD if you want to. Or just just do what you gotta do. But the artwork looks really nice. I enjoyed it. Um, I'm looking forward to this movie. I'm curious. I'm gonna look up to see who their Japanese cast are. Maybe I'll recognize some of the cast members. Meito Majo no Hana. So as you saw in the trailer, it's by, uh, based on the book The Little Broomstick by Mary Stewart. If you read the book, if you read the book, I wonder how it's going to compare to the book. Kind of, you know, I talked about in a previous episode, previous sh video about Howl's Moving Castle. And that hat, that hat, that little bit of it. How that was based off a of book too and the kind of differences between the books and similarities kind of stuff. <gasps> the Otto's <laughs> get caught me. <laughs> I want to see this in Japanese now. Just because, um, the guy who plays pizza, you know, the guy, the... The guy that's friends with Mary, he's the Donosuke Kamiki, and if you haven't seen my previous one, he was in, um, he was in How's Moving Castle, he was Mako, and now he's gonna play Pita. Pita! He's also, if you ever seen the movie, um, Your Name or Kimi no Namae, he plays the main dude, so he's a pretty popular actor. Jiro Sato sounds familiar. <gasps> Jiro Sato is in this. <gasps> Jiro Sato is also an actor. He's also a writer. I didn't know that, but he's um he's been um from what I know of him, he's been in a lot, like a lot of the as uh, minor characters. But he's always been funny in his, in the movies I've seen him in. I always enjoyed his performances and dramas and movies that he's been in. Mary, so Mary and the Witch's Flower it already released in Japan, which is probably. It's probably a must. It released on July 8th of 2017. See you guys later in my next vlog. Vlog. My next video. See you guys later. Bye. Wait. My bad. So, I found... I should have just went to the company's YouTube in the first place because they have the actual Japanese. Like, it's, it's the actual Japanese language trailer. The actual Japanese dub, I guess. But anyway, we're going to watch that one of the trailer right now. And let me watch my boys jam yam nam nam Neonosuke Kamiki and Jiro Sato Is this in the English one? I feel like I missed this in the English one. popular band in Japan. <laughs> Why am I more emotional in the Japanese one than the English one? Like, can you, can you, can you see? Can you see? I, I look really scary now, but can you see those tears? Those are tears, bruh! Those are tears! Oh, I kind of, I teared up in that movie. I do get very emotional on when watching movies and trailers, so people, so this is not really new to me, but, but yeah, the Japanese version made me more emotional than the, the, the American one. I feel like it's the music. It could be the music. The music helped, and I feel like there was more, I don't know what, like, I didn't, okay. I don't know if I was not paying attention in the English dub, 
But I did not realize that she's just a witch for a night. She's just a witch for that night, right? Like, I know how Peter, Peter escapes and all that stuff, but I don't know. I didn't, I don't, I just, no, I just got emotional on this part. But yeah, I really want to see, I'll just see, <laughs> maybe I'll see English though, so that one at least I won't cry as much <laughs> if I watch the Japanese version. But yeah, I really want to see this movie. I hope you guys go see it too. When you watch this, watch this trailer yourself, uh, like, did you get emotional? I got emotional. I don't even know why. I really like the voices though. I, I guess, yeah, it's another one for me. Like, I think the English one is not that bad, but I really like the Japanese one. I feel like if I get the DVD, I will watch it in Japanese and then I'll just watch it in English. But I feel like if I watch it so many times as Japanese, the English will just be weird for me. Maybe, I don't know. Sorry, you guys. I, I just... I just did this again. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video again. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!